up and uh, say a few words. It was the late 80s. I was sitting on my futon in my off-the-shoulder shirt watching Cop Rock. <laughs> if you remember, it was a dramatic legal TV show uh, with singing, <laughs> which is a fantastic idea. And a woman came on who had sold her baby for crack. <laughs> no, I'm not joking. And she started singing, and I thought, Oh my God, first of all, how can she be such a good actress singing on a cop show about selling her baby for crack? <laughs> and who is that brilliant actress and who is that singer? Turned out to be Céline Dion. It <laughs> 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 was Kathleen Bell White, and um, here's the thing. Some people are like very beautiful, some people are great friends, some people are really good at writing music that really moves you. Some people are great at writing lyrics. That's even more rare. And some people have voices like nobody you've ever heard before. The annoying thing is that <laughs> Kathleen Wilhoyt has that all. Please enjoy one of my favorite singer-songwriters in the universe, Kathleen Wilhoyt and the G Street Band! <laughs> everyone out there on the internet, hello. Um, anyway, well, I thought that I'd start off with a song uh, that I wrote about my pals in Nashville. Um, <laughs> okay, here it goes. <laughs> Give me a beer and 
hopeless driving down that carefree road. Oh, but you showed me all the wrong way signs in the guardrails, and you left me here where the air's clear and I found my way home. Then you drove. If you're watching my internet friends, um, if you want to know what my life's like today, here's a song. <laughs> I wrote a song about it. Goes something like this. Okay. It's cool. Oh, it's called Somebody to Worry About. That's good. <laughs> Gotta get up, make the lunches, fry some eggs, beat the bus, and make sure everyone's on time. Then it's solitude and coffee, read the paper, pay some bills, and make some calls, and then stand in. part I am satisfied till the thought runs through my mind oh, of what I could have been if I turned back the hands of time out on the road with no one to worry about wind in my head no one to worry about singing songs to smile
outside I got my suitcase in my hand I'm on the stairs and on the precipice of no man's land I see you playing football on the street and on the fly The leaves are turned, the bridges burn My secret lives terrible um, dater. <laughs> I was like the epitome of a dead thing. Anyway, one of the things that I, uh, I um, hated was when you have a fling, except for you're the guy that they're having a fling with. You know, that's a terribly thankless part. Anyway, I was, I, I was the guy that the, somebody had a fling with, and then he worked it out with his girlfriend, and they got back together again. <laughs> so he left me with a song, which is called Pick Up Where You Left Off. I guess I caught you at a bad time You had better things to do I could still slip out the back door unnoticed and the name's familiar but I can't place you I'm the soul myself off and act like nothing ever happened when the damage has been done and there's no place left
Verse. Did I sing the last verse? You did. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I spaced out. <laughs> Missed the last. Oh, great. That's all on there, on the internet. <laughs> I got it. I nailed it. <laughs> all right, so this next song um, I put next to that song because I borrowed from myself. This one's called Bury, Bury Your Head in the Sand. So I borrowed. There's a lyric in that last one. If I sang that right verse, right? So you're like, what are you doing, Kathleen? Shut up, just sing. <laughs> All right, so this one's called Bury Your Head in the Sand. Good. Uh, Hell down in the wishing well and bury your head in the sand. And if you can't find your voice, you think you got no choice, please bury your head in the sand. And since no one could understand, convince them you're real. similar to the pick up where you left off thing. <laughs> it's just, I feel like I'm most inspired when you try to try to gather up your, you know, your self-esteem and, and you have to walk on, you know, I'm, oh, Kathy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you're like, Kathleen, it's, okay. All right, um, 
<laughs> no, I'm, I'm saying, you know, when you, um, I think my, like love songs, I don't write very many love songs. I wrote the someone to worry about. There's, that's my husband, David Hart. <laughs> He's my someone. Actually, he probably worries about me more on a live stream. This is Kay Bess. <laughs> Jean Reed. Danny Pinella, Chris Joyner, Rick Mar Markman. All right. Anyway, here we go. It, it speaks for itself. Just if Dave ever leaves me, my advice, don't date me. Don't leave me, please. I'm serious. So I'm not the girl of your dreams I can take a hint But you're not exactly Bruce Springsteen and jeans Don't flatter yourself I just thought we'd pass the time Pretending we were meant to be When you touched my face I thought somehow you loved me Why? 
not played on this guitar. <laughs> okay. What should we do? What's it? Damn these eyes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> sure. All right, I wrote this song for one of the funniest girls I know. And I wrote it the last day I saw her on this earth.
said, show me there's God in you. I'm not going to play another sad song. <laughs> I feel depressed. <laughs> this song I wrote is about, my friend told me this story. He was on the No Nukes tour, and he was a drummer, and his drum tech was his Coke dealer, and he could stick his hand through the curtains, and, and he would have Coke on his thing. The guy would, would do a bump, you know, and then keep playing. And uh, his drum tech was this guy named Harold. Anyway, the guy told the story. It was great. And I, I went home and, and I wrote a song about it. <laughs> or something like this. <laughs> anyway, here we go. Ready? Come, let, let, get us in. <laughs>
right, so I'll do one more song, yes? Yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Before I get the hook, <laughs> I won't tell any more stories. <laughs> so I'm not nailing that, I told you. <laughs> this is just one of my favorite songs. Thank you very much.